free, Red. I wouldn't celebrate just yet. Man, you need to lighten up. Hell, you might even try smiling. <laughs> what? <laughs> On second thought, maybe frowning suits you better. Hey, don't pout. <laughs> Look. What? Oh, 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 oh! Are you guys seeing this? What does that even mean? What does that even mean? What is all this? <sighs> Interesting. So Rufus can see them, but Sun cannot. I think that's what that meant. Sir. Stand by, sir. Your orders. Bring them in. It's like the whole damn building's made of them. Yeah. I don't understand. What are they doing? Great question. Who knows? Wait. You don't think he got caught up in it, do you? If he did, I hope he's okay. Uh. They're coming. Who? <gasps> this we don't need. Time to go. <laughs> we on this again? Oh my god. All right. Here's hoping I get a kiss. All a cutscene, so I don't have to work for this, or they're gaining on us. Come on, step on it. I'm trying, but it won't go any faster. How the hell do we get saddled with this jump? Canonically, it's what happens. Okay, here we go. Let's take these guys out. All right. 
right, next. Unexpected. <laughs> that guy. Woo! Did you see his baton? No, thank you. Oh, 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 they shoot me. There's nowhere to run. Ow! Get ahead of them. When do you fight back? Oh, this thing sucks. Oh, this truck sucks. All right, so we can get up in here. Yep. We do this. You, <laughs> that works. Get ahead of them. I'm trying to run my friends off the road. Oh hell no! All right. Show me what you can do. Look at what is happening up here. Like Fast and Furious! Oh my god! Okay. These guys are driving so fast. I feel like a grandpa back here on my motorcycle. Like, slow down, damn it! You kids are driving too fast! All right, let's do this. Ow, ow, God, dang it. All right, so I just need to get around to the other side, but like I can't, they're going so fast. So no matter what, as long as these guys are out, I cannot catch them. Is that the, ow. Is that how this works? So close to death. End yourself. Stubborn bastards. Look. Come on. So I kind of get to decide where those shots go. Oh, all right. Hey, fight's not over yet. Cloud, here. Oh, Red, thank you. <laughs> Try catching us now, you bastards. I hate to spoil the celebration. There's more. Oh. Uh, We're kind of in a hurry. I'll take that. This guy, come on. You don't need to do that. There we go. Don't come back. Uh, what the? What the hell is this thing? I'm counting on you. Whoa! What the what? Just, just go away. Oh, this thing. This thing sucks. Okay. Oh, oh, keep my guard up, yeah. Oh! Working on it! Context clues, they help you! Okay. That shit sucks. Ow! 
Okay, so when he falls back, shield up. Okay, maybe not. All right, now shield up. Bring it down. All right. Keep your dog. <laughs> Thanks, team. Working together. Okay. The hell you! No, oh, why'd I keep cycling back through that? Let's pick up the pace. Okay. Do your thing, you! Do your thing, you! There we go. Is that that? Is that that? Come on, die already! Oh my god. Oh my god. They saved him once again. Mm -hmm. Shit, we got income. I'll take the job. The fights are all yours, Cloud. No, oh, what the shit? Okay, well, I have totally screwed up. Preparing to engage the target. Targeting vehicle's wheel. Woo! That was neat, but totally. Oh, come on! Firing warning shot. I am be pinned in. So now they're doing a pattern? Yeah, I can live with a pattern. Preparing to engage the target. So it's going two. Oh, come on! I couldn't get over because they were blocking me. Target's acquired. Oh, this sucks. Okay, well, 
least now I can do the mechanics correctly. Holy Pajoli. Look at that. It's not hard. I was just like overwhelmed. So how do I take on a helicopter? That's it. I'm taking you down. Ah. He does it. We done here. Yep, once again. You good? Somehow. Hey, uh, you Red. Okay? I love you. So now, they're I love on our you. Side. The Whisperers intervene, not to defend us, but to preserve the flow of destiny. Oh boy, here we go. Boss time. This is the original final boss of this portion of the game. Of Midgar. I highly doubt this is the final boss of this game. Come on, you see the piece of shit we're driving here. Says the 300 pound sack of it. Hey! Whoa! <laughs> Those boys. Comedy duo. Oh, you. Alright, back off. You can do it. I'm working on it. You're kind of in a hurry. Don't give up now, you guys. God. Get ready. Trying to get in there is so like Focus. controller tough. Like, hey, look at me! Look at me Don't swing around back. like this! That's okay. That's okay. We'll do it. We'll do it. Oh, you suck. Oh, you suck, mister. But that's good that he put it up in the front now. So I can just get up to here and not all the way up. The hell? All right, how did I end up all the way up here? I'm literally trying to break. <laughs> I guess because I was grinding on it. There we go. That hit me? I guess because I was on this side of the road. I don't know. Mechanically works, but I know I can do this. Is that doing nothing? Oh, I don't feel like I'm doing any damage to this guy. Oh, what the shit? Okay, well, and he regenerates. Oh, this sucks. Oh, this guy is a dick. Okay. Show me what you can do. I'm sorry, what is happening on that side? Hopefully nothing I have to deal with. Oh my god, what is he doing? What is this? What is whoa? What is this? Still it. This might be it. Now just stop grinding on his wheel, Cloud, and let's do this thing. There's only one wheel we need to grind on, and it's this one right here. Now get next to it. Wow, get next to the wheel! Wow! Oh, 
All right, all right. Get back in there. Get back in there, buddy. This, the angle on this is so out of whack, I can't get to it. Wow, oh, that sucks. Oh, I don't like this fight at all. Okay. Show me what you can do. Like, I was trying to move towards it and nothing was happening. No time for you. Because the angle was so out of whack. Oh, my God. My friends are getting roasted. I want to find out about. We got this game. Okay, here comes the oh, Orbeez. Yup, yup. Hang in there, okay? The hell is that? The hell is he shooting now? Keep it up. The sky is filled with ghosts. Oh my god, why am I looking at the sky and not the road? Focus, Jesse. Come on, just get up to that wheel. Oh, this is a trap. I can end this right uh, now. God damn it. Okay, we, we kind of got it, I think. Get in there, Cloud. That's it? Oh, my God. Okay, y'all. Let's finish him off. Come on. Go for the head. With pleasure. And the road for you. <laughs> and this is normally where Midgar would end. What is about to happen here? We go, we look out over the edge. We'd be blown away by the fact that, oh my God, there's a save point there. Or not a save point, but you know what I mean? Like, a, what is happening? 
All right, let's do this. We're gonna, I'm gonna pop back up. I'm gonna go through everything and make sure I'm prepared for whatever the hell this is gonna be. I don't know what is happening right now. Okay, can't, all right, can't do that. Let's do this. Uh, weapons, oh my God, yes. All right, all right. I'm gonna go through this really quickly. Uh, I'm probably gonna edit this part out because I imagine it's gonna take forever. I'm gonna try and find out what the best weapon is based on what I got going on. Okay, so I have spent a lot of time <laughs> messing with this because I feel like it's only fitting. We're going back to the Buster Sword. 75, 75, 11, 11. It's not as good in one way or another, but it does have both defenses, which I like. I lose some materia, but they were materia that everyone else has. I kept Tifa and Aerith the same. I went through and was like, eh, we're good. I did give Aerith the wind and ice materia that Cloud had, so hopefully we'll be good on that end. And for Barret, I went with the Gatling gun, uh, honestly just for the aesthetic, I'll be real. I'm trying to explain myself out of this, but really I just felt like having the Buster Sword and the Gatling gun felt right. That's all. I just, you know, for the cutscenes and stuff, I'm excited. I guess we'll see if basing your equipment off of end game cutscene aesthetics pays off, but uh, I'm definitely gonna save. Excuse me, I just would like to buy some end of the road mega potions and whatnot. You know, you know, for the totally not boss fight and definite happy ending credit scenario that I'm gonna have right now, right? One elixir, why not? I am full on expecting a crazy Final Fantasy boss. You know it's gonna be like Exodark. The sin of man or some crazy shit. I'm ready for it. Although it'd be equally surprising to just get to the end and it'd be like, you've done it. Here's a world map and just blow everyone's mind. But I, I feel like we need answers on these ghosts. I got a feeling we're gonna get something right now, but I don't know if it's gonna be answers. There we go, I see it. Am I gonna fight Sephiroth right now? How? Why? Okay, asshole, let's... And you, you're wrong. Those who look with clouded eyes see nothing but shadows. Everything about you is wrong. All born are bound to her. Should this world be unmade, so too shall her children. The world won't end today. For you. You will. Destiny comes. Wait, what? Drag our asses all this way. This is the welcome we get. <sighs> boy, oh boy. 
The price of freedom is steep. Embrace your dreams. And whatever happens, protect your honor as a soldier! Come and get it! This is the point of no return. Destiny's Crossroads. Then why did you stop me? I'm not really sure. What will we find on the other side? Freedom. Boundless. Terrifying freedom, like a great, never-ending sky. What you heard just now were the voices of the planet. Those born into this world, who lived and who died, who returned, are howling in pain. Because of him, Sephiroth? They... Their words... They don't reach him. All these moments and memories, precious and fleeting, they're like rain rolling off his back. And when they're gone, he won't cry or shout or anything. He'd tell you that he only cares about the planet, that he'd do everything in his power to protect and preserve it. But this isn't the way it's supposed to be. There's no greater threat to the planet than him. Sephiroth has to be stopped. He has to be. And that's why... I'm asking you to help me. I know that together, we can do this. But if we do... We'll be changing more than fate itself. If we succeed, if we win, we'll be changing ourselves. I guess... Maybe... That's why I hesitated. You said it yourself. He has to be stopped. And frankly, I've heard enough howling for a lifetime.
When you cross the barrier of whispers, strange and terrible things may be waiting on the other side. Before making the leap, make sure that your party is well rested, well stocked, and equipped with materia. The vending machine back. Madness. This is madness. So, what I assume is happening is that because we saw Zach at some point in the timeline, you know, because I guess time isn't a straight line, right? So, at some point, the swirly ghosts are back then. They are now. All the key intersections of important moments in Final Fantasy VII are kind of like overlaying on each other. And Aerith is like, hey, if we make this, if we go in there and we do this, and what I assume is going to be like, I don't even know what I assume it's going to be like. <laughs> I assume it's going to be like a multi-dimensional something or other. She's like, whatever we do in here will change everything. My question is, is this going to be one of those things where Aerith is like, look, we could not do this and everything would play out the normal way it would. Or we enter and we have a chance to change the game from what it was. I mean, we're do obviously we're doing it, but we'll talk more in the credits because I have thoughts. Also, I can just walk back to Red. Red, what are you? Is it our destiny? Fine, Destiny. It's an interesting question. Very. That's what I'm on. Red and I, we're on the same shit. So if we go through that thing, there's no coming back. Cloud, we should go. Thank you, Cloud. Do they say anything else, or is it just the one thing? I don't know what kind oh. of freedom we're buying, but I know it'll cost us. So if we go through that thing, there's no coming back. Will there be whispers on the other side? I don't know. I. If we wait any longer, I don't know. Whatever happens, we'll be okay, as long as we stick together. She's so calm about this. And, oh, all right, no speculation. Let's just do this. Ready? Yeah. Never tried to challenge destiny. This could well be her last line of defense. It won't be easy. Let's go. Also, those ghosts got so big. Holy crap. You, but looks normal to me. Over there. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh my god, they did go full Final Fantasy. Yup, this is a final boss, all right. Creating black holes? Yeah, we in it. Combat, so I'm actually not running. Whoop. I I'm not even fighting against Sephiroth. I'm fighting against Destiny itself. Get out of here, ghost. Happy to see me? Wouldn't go that far. So that thing. A whisper too, huh? Looks a lot more like an arbiter of fate than the others. We can beat them. What the hell? Ha! Bring it on. <laughs> Let's go, team. <laughs> Very hard. Uh, let me assess these fools. Whisper Rebrum? Is that supposed to be murder? Instead of Red Rum? I. Maybe I'm looking into this <laughs> a little, little too much. Crocio? Oeg? Orc? No. Uh, what are they? Okay. Let's see what's what. I got some notes. Okay. Unable to read. They're resistant to all sorts of things. An entity from a future timeline that is manifested in present day. It fights with a sword to protect the future that gave shape to it. It fights barehanded to protect the future that gave shape to it. It fights with guns to protect the future that gave shape to it. Interesting. I was about to say, oh, this one fights with us. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. This is the big daddy. Uh, So-called arbiters of fate. Okay, they're connected to all the threads of time and space that shape the planet's fate. All right, anyway, I was going to say this guy has a sword. This person is uh, barehanded. So I was like, oh, obviously Cloud and Tifa, and they're fighting future versions of themselves. But this person has guns, plural. And there's never a future version of Barrett that has two guns. So I don't think those are... Well, I don't know what I think. We'll figure, we'll figure this out. Oh, whoa, whoa! Okay, maybe we do... Counter stance on this guy. I'm waiting. This guy stinks. Uh-oh. What is that? Inviolate? I don't know what that means. Whoa! Okay, that. Sucks. Let's try that again. Now. 
There we go, team. F this dude up. Uh, Braver. Woo! Oh, he's gone. Oh, look at that. Good work, gang. Oh, okay, correct. Oh, I don't know. Okay. Come on, that ain't fair. Run. They left the party. That'll do. Okay, run. We gotta go. Just go. Oh my God, we're going up like. <laughs> oh my God. Shit. Look out. No more falling, Cloud. Well, never mind. We're back. All right, let's kill Red Rum over here. Um, what if we hit him with the counter stance right away? Yeah, that works. Oh, that was too slow. Damn, that ability is like so ridiculous. Alright, I got Crimson Art. It's fine, we can do spells. Normal cure, right? Oh, this ass. Dude threw the world at me! <laughs> Alright, let's go over here and let's do uh your uh on cloud and we'll go over here and we'll do Maximum Fury! Alright, that guy's gone. That dude definitely has two guns. Brace yourself. Uh, abilities. Star shower this hater. Oh, never mind. Oh. We gotta get out of here now! There's the Minecraft world again. Here we are. Midgard by Mojang. Oh my god. We have to fight this thing? Woo! Alright, back again. Temper. Temper this shit, asshole. Counter stance. Okay, he is nasty. No one's abilities are up yet. So nasty. You are so nasty. Maximum Fury will end that. And then we'll do... Roasted. Oh my god, that guy. Oh, when we do this and this... Oh, fascinating. Okay. Let's do... Awesome. Wow. Got it. Did we do it? Hang on. Oh. Eric. What? 
Wait, so do we change that? What the hell did I just see? Post credit scene from Final Fantasy VII. It's what you just saw. Tomorrow, if we fail here today. If we fail here? What does that mean? <laughs> oh, if they fail, it'll reset back to the way it's supposed to be? Is that the implication? All right. These two assholes. Damn it! How do we stop these things? Well, the big one is way over there. However, these guys are right here. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna. All right. Right now. Yeah. Really hope that I'll spells. Yeah, yeah, yo, yeah, 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 ye. Erode? These guys are assholes. Oh my god. Oh my god, how do I? Correction. Wait, what? Wait, what? Uh, can I poison these guys? Oh wait, no, that's that's the opposite of what I want to do. What if I You're up taking over? I don't know, probably casting thunder on the yellow guy was a dumb choice. this fool. Okay, so that's out. That's awful. Staggered again. I think that's what needed to happen. What if I just keep attacking something, maybe? Let's use an item. Back in it.
Nice. I almost have my limit break. God. This can't be our future. <gasps> the future is always a blank page. Uh, them again! Least they could do is give us a little breather. I say we split up. Take them down at the same time. In that case. Ultra big boys all mine. Team back, Aerith. Spells, please, for the love of all that's holy, keep Cloud alive. Say goodbye. Line up, assholes. Ew, that did a thing, I guess. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? Bahamut? Let's do this. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's exactly what it is. God. Okay. This is all happening right now. Let's. We'll wait. We'll wait. We'll wait. We'll summon V summon. If I can. Mega flare, get the hell out of here with this mega flare bull. Can I move out of the way of it, or am I just? Yep. Umbral strikes. Multiple strikes over and over. What is the strategy here? What is the strategy here? I can't figure this out to save my items. We'll use Phoenix down on Cloud. Not throwing in the towel. Alright, let's do spells. Kuraga on Tifa. Why don't you lead the way? So I just need to switch between people. Take the lead. Here. This looks like yeah, all right, I'll wait. Spells. Please, sweet baby Jesus, make this work. Just stuck in like a cure deficit that I cannot get out of. You're Look at this. You 
know what? If that's all it took. Gotta give it my all. <laughs> that's how that works. Oh my god. And then we're back to here. Can't do Leviathan yet. Hope you're ready. That's right, get your ass hurt, fool. Ray of judgment on this fool. Ready? I'm gonna show you what happened. There we go. I mean, that's just <laughs> that, I guess. We do it? Holy crap. Try to just walk away. Get out of here. Go home. No. Eh, we'll let Ifrit have this one. Give him hell, pal. We're good. I mean, we're good across the board. All right. Look at these guys. Look at these. Squeenix. We did it. <laughs> Freed's like, don't forget about me. Is that going to hit all the way over there? Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. Amazing. <sighs> wow. 
where are we? I'm waiting, Cloud. <gasps> Full Advent children on this shit. <sighs> what? Do I have to fight him right now? Let's finish this. Oh my god. <laughs> Fate is not to be okay. taken lightly, Cloud. Shut up! No. You suck. Can I assess him? Cause I'm gonna. Best do it right. Unable to read. Unable to read. Resistant to all. Good to know. That should be fine. <laughs> I tried to block that too. <laughs> Uh, let's do counter stance if he's gonna come at me like a crazy person. I'm waiting. Oh, he's pressured? Well, ow. Come slow. Uh, you suck. Uh, let me do this. Come on. Dude, I was busy healing. Just trying to have we forgotten already? Uh <laughs> I clearly have because I'm making every wrong choice imaginable. Alright, enough of this. No holding back. There we go. Within. Brace yourself. Did I hit him? Maybe. Come on. Beg for forgiveness. Okay. There we go. There we go. Let's get this over with. He moved out the way. He was like, nah, I don't even care. Oh no, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. This is bad news. Take it from here. Okay, let's 
Okay, that didn't really. No, nope. get for still in. Hang back. <laughs> Come on, don't overdo it. Oh, it's nothing. I got this. <laughs> oh my god. All right. This has to work. I just am doing it wrong. Hell's Gate seems like a thing. No. <laughs> He's so pressured. Get him, girl. Get him. Well, well. Damn, this ain't pretty, but we doing it. Star shower is ass. Switch back, get over here, abilities. Disorder, right? Now's our chance. Now's our chance. I've got this. No holding back. I'll end this. I'm there, but like. Sloppy. Dude, pulling out one wing. That's how this team works, dude. That's how this team works, dude. Ain't you two having fun? Let's go. Beg for forgiveness. Let's do this. Got it up. That like somehow that would help. Ah! 
You can see it on the ground, kind of. Anytime. You, sir, are an asshole. Duty calls. What if I just get out the way? Oh no! Oh no! No! Ow! Oh, the memories. So if it's infused with fire, resistance to ice. Right. Gotcha. So really, I should be using actual spells, which I have none of. I can't believe I <laughs> didn't it say to be prepared. I should have used Shiva. Ah, uh, ain't that about to be okay? Haste, cloud. So I can't break through while he's doing this shit. He has to use ice. He has to become ice infused. <laughs> the only way I win is if he becomes ice. <laughs> <laughs> This is the most Jesse version of a final battle I've ever seen. Oh my ass. Oh, that's so funny. So she's stuck in it. Yep, that's cool. He's on the other side of it. Yep, that's cool. Keep it together. It doesn't necessarily say that he's... Give him hell. All set. Oh my god! Oh my god! How the hell? <laughs> Did you see that bullshit? This is... No more games. Just gonna roll out the way, take a bunch of hits. <laughs> This is nonsensical. Right for me. Oh, thank God. Okay. Right at this shit, asshole. You're up. Leviathan, you showed up, you looked cool, but I don't know that you're gonna do damage. But I love you for it. Yo, I mean that's damage. See you soon. You're up. I got you. F this one. I can't believe you knocked me out of it. I'm so heartbroken. Come on, beg for forgiveness. Elemental infusion. Check out this shit right here. You got this. So it's resistant to everything, but maybe now physical is the way to go. Oh my goodness. Shadow Flare. Shadow Flare. Whoa! No thank you. Oh, come on. I always think I have the in when I don't. You will be white. It's on you. Keep hitting him with that. There we go. I got Dude, get effed. Let's dance, asshole. Let's finish it. This is, this is where we're at, huh? 
that. Okay, roll out the way. Oh, all right. Well, that shit is literally everywhere. My turn. Nine. There's a countdown. Oh no. Tifa, Dolphin Fury, this asshole. Girl got it. The girl still has it, baby. Oh, we in that inside place now. Oh, no. So it's kind of like the end of the first game. Careful now. That which lies ahead does not yet exist. Our world will become a part of it one day, but I will not end, nor will I have you end. This is... The Edge of Creation. Cloud, lend me your strength. Let us defy destiny together. <laughs> Never. Oh, it straight up is the end of the game. Title screen! Seven seconds till the end. Time enough for you, perhaps. But what will you do with it? Let's see. What does that mean? Seven seconds till the end? Now there's the title screen! Seven seconds, what does that mean?
Mr. Vice President. Mr. President. That's right. <laughs> oh, Rufus is too good. This isn't just a different reality. Stamp was different. So this is an uh, alternate reality? Did you see that? Where the two of them live? The realities intersect? Was that the result of the battle with Sephiroth? Is this because all of time is sort of layered? Is that what that means? What does it mean? I mean, it, this is our reality. So they obviously didn't notice any crazy explosions, so it just had to have been in Zack's timeline in which he lives? Ghosties clearly didn't get everything. I mean, Marlene, coming. Keep eating cutie pie. You keep eating cutie pie.
Molly. <laughs> that man loves his child. I'll come back. So now we continue so, on to the rest of the game? Now? Yeah. Uh, Aerith doesn't know. Implying she did know before! Sephiroth. As long as he's still out there, I... I thought you beat him. We can. We will. Count me in. If it's to be a hunt, you could use a nose like mine. I'm in too. Bastard wants to destroy the whole planet, doesn't he? An enemy of hers is an enemy of Avalanche. So what are they gonna do with this storyline then? Almost there, Cloud. We're almost there. I'm blown away by how ballsy this is. This is like into fanfic territory. Things that people on forums have been talking about for decades. So do they? Does she know? She feels something's different? Is that the whole... I miss it. The steel sky. All right, so I'm just going to talk over this part because everyone told me the ending was super mega copyrightable. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to hope that doesn't happen. But if it does, eh, it was a great game anyway. But this is good because now I can talk to you about all the things that have been inside of me. I have ideas and thoughts and I have so much swirling in me. I will simply say... If you don't want spoils for the rest of Final Fantasy VII, if you've never played the old game, if you don't want to know what's going to happen, uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you will continue to watch the channel and support all the other videos. I'm giving you that second. I'm letting you know we're going to get into spoils. So if you want spoilers, if you want to get real deep divey into the lore, that is about to happen in three, two, one. Holy shit. There are now two timelines or multiple timelines? Like... Zack is alive in a timeline with Cloud. And that version seems like a different reality because the chip bag was the clue, right? It was a different stamp. But then there was the explosion and we saw the ghosts. So are they now connected in some way? They walked by each other, but they didn't see each other. How does that play a role in the future? Also, the dialogue clearly hinted that Final Fantasy VII, the ending we got in the original game, was the bad ending. That could just be me reaching and maybe what Red was saying was, if we lose, we go back to just the reality that's gonna play out. But it seemed like to me, when I was a kid, that when you beat the original Final Fantasy VII, there was that post credit scene and that always upset me because it seemed like as Red was running through the canyon and he looked out on Midgar with these red kids, I guess, it seemed like everyone was dead that humanity had died out and it was the bad ending. Like, it was a sad ending. And then if you watched Advent Children, it indicated that after Meteor, the world was kind of dying away and people were getting sick. Speaking of Advent Children, oh my God, I have so many thoughts. It hit me when I mentioned it earlier that the three bosses that were the spirits, right? They were like, from a future. While it is very, very possible that they are twisted versions of our heroes or the weapons, right? It's also possible they're like the uh, Sephiroth kids, the three Genova kids. I don't remember any of their names at all. I think one was called Kadaj. I didn't think it was a great movie anyway, so, you know. But 
I, I wonder if that's connected, right? Because that's part of the timeline. Oh my God. I just like, I, I, we have to talk about Aerith too. Like Aerith 100% has experienced all this before. From early in the game, it was super obvious that she was different from everyone else. I think Sephiroth 2, maybe even Red 13, maybe because they're linked to the planet, maybe something else, I don't know, but they definitely are repeating this story. The question is, is this the first time? Aerith seems resigned to her fate. Her voice seems to be constantly flat, and like at first I thought, oh, that's a character choice to make her seem more non-threatening. Uh, I don't know. Now I'm convinced it's because she's resigned to her own death. She knows that it's going to happen. And maybe because it's happened numerous times, she has to sacrifice herself for the planet every time. Especially after that scene outside of her house at night, when she just like, don't come save me, right? I, it seems like she thinks you can change fate now though, and I don't know why that is. I don't know what the impetus of that is. But no matter what, there are now major questions regarding the timeline. Like the original game, when Cloud meets Sephiroth in that weird space between worlds thing, is that the branching point? Does Advent Children even happen at all? Or did Aerith never experience the first game and it, it's like just a vision that she and all the people connected to the world experience and so she's trying to alter that fate that has not even been written yet. But then once they exit the portal, there are two timelines? Unless, oh my God, unless Zack is in our timeline and has been the entire time and the ghosts appeared at that point and actually everything has changed from that moment. Oh my God, I don't even, this is, I don't even know what to say here. All I know is that uh, the ghosts, I told you we'd talk about them. They definitely in the game are said to be fate and destiny trying to force the heroes down the path they're supposed to go down, right? Okay, I don't think that's a mystery anymore. I feel like they pretty much said that in the game, but what if? Crazy theory. I've been thinking about this for a while. What if they aren't spirits of ancients or whatever? What if this is so this is so nuts? What if they are the players? The millions of players who know the story, who knew what they thought the story was gonna be, expected it to go a certain way, and the creators were like, no. And the game is going full meta and that the characters in it are fighting us, the players and what we are trying to make them do. And all of our expectations were what was putting it back on track. I know it's wacky. I know it's probably way off, but like, it's kind of cool, right? I kind of love it. There's the line about seven seconds till the end. I, I have no idea what that means. Maybe you have some guess I would love to see. Please leave it in the comments. We'll definitely do a gentleman's gaming club on this. It's going to happen. We'll get into more detail. I just, I'm overwhelmed with ideas right now, and I think I just need time to think about them, but hopefully you're all ready for more Final Fantasy because I am psyched. Thank you all so much for watching. You're amazing. I'm, I'm hype. I'm hype on this game. Wow. This is the kind of insanity that I love. You know me. If a game gets weird and this game got super weird, I am down. All right. That's it for me. Thank you so much. Stick around. More insanity to come on the channel. And as always, to be continued. You know, where's the payoff? Bring the strippers and boots. We do occasionally talk about video games. Bring the strippers and boots. Out of that time of video games. Bring the strippers and boots. Oh, thank God, I don't need pants now. Hey, JC, what are you doing? Not much. Making a fortune. It's a professional broadcast. Yeah, now sing the music. It's a professional broadcast. Bring the strippers and boots. It's a professional broadcast. I'm here to ask and answer one simple question. It's a You got